I thought I'd kind of want a day to myself, but turns out I don't. I especially when my you, bike, man. yeah, especially when you're kind of stuck to this resort, nothing except a sports hall and a tennis court and a football pitch and a pool and a swamp. <laughs> That was a funny bike ride. <laughs> I'll be in there, mate. You've been feeling a bit under the weather. That's a bit of an understatement, isn't it? That's the most sick I've ever seen you the last two days. It's the most sick I've been in fucking ages. We've done a bit of a naughty, haven't we? We've uh, fast forwarded and got a bus. Horrible bus. That you have to go barefoot onto. And we are now in Hawaii. So we've had to, due to my illness, we've had to bypass k San and the jungle. Frankly, where we were, it was pissing with rain. If I'm not well, riding in the pouring rain, I'll be up, I'll be up and dancing in no time at all. Meanwhile, you've been absolutely fine and on the beers. Lawrence properly got on it last night. No, I, didn't. I didn't realize how much you drank last night until I went into the bathroom. The bathroom was about eight, eight tinnies. Have you seen this guy's drone footage? Are you sure you don't want to stay here for a couple of days? <laughs> have, you, have you booked for two nights? I can bring you go somewhere else. Yeah, that's you know, We would love to do that. For a photo, for the video, for yeah. something like this. My room's, my room's just here, look. Oh, we've got separate ones? Yeah. That's such a shame. Yeah, that's all right. This isn't right. Hawaii is by far the coolest city we've been to. Really nice, isn't it? It feels a lot, more Westerners there, look. We've seen more Westerners in the last, what, 15 minutes than we have done the in the whole last trip. three weeks. <laughs> You put that in front of me, Francis. So, we've flown 6,000 miles. It's gone for Italian food. No, 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 this is Vietnamese, Vietnamese Italian. Italian food. Vietnamese Italian. Why are we going to the DMZ? DMZ is the American expression for demilitarized de zone. Yeah. And it's of significance in Hawaii because only a little bit north from here, and we, we drove past it this afternoon, um, we came through uh, the 17th parallel. One of the 17 horizontal, well, parallels of the earth where Vietnam was split into north and south and so on. Now Vietnam is one lovely country. Back on the road again after a bit of much needed R&R. &R. James has got over his flu. Just what we needed. Welcome to the amazing city of Hue. We're just on our way out, heading towards Haivan Pass, which will be the highlight of today. It's about a thousand meters in one go, and our final destination, Da Nang. Feels really good to be riding again. We've got some great stuff coming up. So nice to be back on the road, man. Isn't it? Feels like a long time we had off. Oh, James is smashing it. He's definitely he's better. better. Yeah. He's got a bee in his bonnet and he's gone for it. I'm back! My wounds are healed. I feel better. Da Nang, I'm coming for you. the tail fin it's a mud guard as well so we're on this main road for a little bit longer and about 40 miles in we'll take a turning off hit the high van pass and hit some serious gradient for now this is just a bit of a means to an end not too bad though at least the rain's warm slow down the bleeding. now in america we didn't need to take rain capes i'd almost go as far as say you don't need a rain cape though yeah it's so hot you just unzipped yeah. yours there's all types of rain there's slanting rain there's big old fat rain, there's stinging rain, and sometimes there's rain that looks as though it's coming from up. Why don't we buy one of these ponchos? You 
very kindly helped me tie these knots in my bag. So I can't, I can't get it out again. Look. Idiot. <laughs> I've never eaten so many greens in my life. It's daily the shower now. Yeah. It's better than the shower at uh, Halong Bay. Shower? <laughs> yeah, it's just a bucket. Another eight percent sign. They've only got eight percent signs. There we go. High van pass. Completed it. Well, we haven't got down yet. That was pretty cool. It was quite nice that it wasn't 35 degrees and sunny actually as well. Can you imagine? It would have been hard. Good Welcome to Da Nang. Why are you so short? <sighs> because you're still on a box. So fantastic descent. Weather's cleared up a bit. We've now got 15k flat all the way to uh, Da Nang, where we're actually going to spend another day, explore a bit, maybe ride some other roads around here. Because of the trip we did on the bus, we've got quite a few rest days to use up. I think it's worth using a few of them up here uh, when we're in the country still, and just using them all in Saigon, which could be an option. <laughs> You know when you've got a dog and it doesn't want to go in the, in, the, in the pond or something? That's basically what he looks like right now. He's got that same demeanor. <laughs> I am not happy about this at all. <laughs> we'll have to shampoo him. 5k to Danang. Started spitting a little bit. Something on fire over there. I need to bind my hands tomorrow. So the wet won't got, help today. Yeah, the rain and the wet and the sweat. <laughs> How was how was that at High Van Pass? Awesome. Like, I mean, well, the viewers would have seen on the GoPro footage when we get to this point. Well, all three of us overtaking trucks, motorbikes, everything, <laughs> just everything. everything. <laughs> it was brilliant, but that whole that whole descent you didn't need to brake. There was a little bit of braking that went on. It's just you know it's an unknown descent, but it's amazing. Power cut. Seems like, to you know, happen quite a lot, doesn't it? Yeah. I mean, this is the second power cut we've sat through. They don't. They don't tend to last for very long. Happy birthday to you. 